next on the fishing pole. Well, that looks perfectly safe. If I find any dead bodies, I'll let you guys know. So where am I? I am in the great Northeast Philadelphia. I'm here back in my hometown. We're gonna do some leftover trout fishing today. We're gonna see if we can catch some of these leftover browns that might be sitting around in the infamous Pennypack Creek. So come on with me and I got a special guest star. So let's do some fishing. Here we go on a long trek down here to the stream. I guess this better be worth it. It's like we're in the middle of a jungle. Believe it or not, we're in a city. <laughs> I don't think I've ever walked harder to get to a fishing spot. Oh, I used to do this when I was a kid and a lot younger. Here's our guest star. You all right? Feeling better going downhill. Yeah, me too. So here we are, spot number one. I'm getting these little bites here. I kind of doubt if it's a trout, but even still, I still want to try to catch it. It's got to be something small, but I want to catch it anyway. I want to see what this is. There's a nice spot all the way downstream there, there's an arch and there's a couple spots in there where I know there's been fish. This is the dam that they usually stock. And I got one. And of course, it's the infamous green sunfish. Official bait dealer of the fishing pole. Hi, guy. That's just biting down there, so. Anything else down there? Nothing? Oh, geez. Sloppy catch and release. You can see right there, there's a struggling turtle. Oh, just dove down. This is truly embarrassing. Another bait stealing green sunfish. Circle hook works good. He's not happy. I'm not happy. See you later, dude. Switch tactics a little bit. Since it's sort of deep here and we're using worms, I just put on my cane pole. That was a hard bite right there. Feels like a sunfish. Let's see if he took my bait. Nope. The bait is still there. like another bite. I just want to see what this is. I don't think it's anything substantial. But I'd rather catch something and get it shut out. Nice day today. Late day in May. They stocked last month. Unfortunately, this is one of the few times I could get here. And of course, what is it? a rather dark color green sunfish. Oh boy. Oh no, wait. Is that a rock bass? Might actually be a little rock bass. 
Let's ask our, let's ask our resident expert over here. What do you think? No, no, that, 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 that. Rock bass? I think it's a rock bass. See how different it is? Yeah. I believe it's a rock bass. So, first rock bass today. Something right here, Timothy. Timothy, get it? Big swirl. Hold on. I don't know what it's doing. Okay. See this? This is a rock bass. It's a, you can see it a lot better. I just caught me a decent sized rock bass here. I think I can take a good look at it. It's got a red eye. It's got green. We're scattered, looks like dots on it. it ah, you're biting me, dude. Now he's biting me. My hook is getting reinserted in my own hand, but rock bass, nice. What's that? They do, some of them get big. Some of them do get pretty big. So after a couple casts, a couple sunfish later, we're gonna try an inline spinner. I did see something jump. I'm hoping it was a trout. It looked kind of dark, might have been a brown. So we're gonna tie on an inline spinner. What'd you have, a stick? Oh, then I found for you. Oh. <laughs> then I see the stomach and it was a big grand. Oh, jeez. Right. Inquiring trouts want to know. I'm feeling a lot of current with this. No bites, unfortunately. Throw it in the foam here. Get a nice spin going. Come on, leftovers, where are you? Although not a fish, I caught me garbage. This is one of the pitfalls of fish in the penny pack here. So, one rock bass, couple couple green sunfish here. Yeah. My dad over here is gonna throw on some big, big trout magnets. He picked up at a Cabela's it's trip. Tiny, it's yellow and orange, so let's try it. They are, you just push push those split shot down by, by the hook, mm -hmm. act like a jig head, and it should, should work just the same. So, let's give it a shot. Looking like a worm. Looks like a worm. Hook them like a worm, I think. Yes, yes. I hope the tree. <laughs> it's my luck today. Ah, oh, come on, do this. Do this, Maximus. I'll be able to see my face now. Yeah. I got a bad habit of lifting this pole up right into a tree. Not a good habit. Dad! Well, mission accomplished, G.I. Joe. Oh my. I told you they were here. Cane pole magic. Brown trout. Let's bring this guy up here. Nice skinny one, too. Holy crap. Mr. Brown Trout. Nice to meet you. Caught him on a cane pole. Did you see it? <laughs> ah, he's coming home. Brown Trout? Yeah, Brownie. What? I thought I saw something swimming in there. Only more than one there. Yeah. There we go, brown trout. Penny pack. No, he's kind of skinny, but he's gonna be dinner. Very nice, very nice. Surprise catch today.
game pole, does it? <laughs> That's amazing. Absolutely amazing. Yeah, thank you, sir. <laughs> got the same one. Thank you, sir. I just got a brown on there. What do you got? You just got a brown here? I got a brown right there. Yeah, I, I just... ran out of rigs. I got four down at home. Uh huh. But I lost my one rig. Uh huh. I got a stainless steel one, too. Like that one? Yeah. And uh, my braids look off awesome sometimes. I love this thing. I absolutely love this thing. Yeah, my braid, like, this is. um. 14 pound braid. Got the wrong end to show you, but you know what it is. Yeah. I got braid up by there by the Lillian, but sometimes if I get aggressive with the cast, I lose it. With Aren't the braid? You here the other day, the last Sunday, weren't you fishing here? Nah, he was here a couple Sundays ago, I think. <laughs> I could have seen all the ones. Like, like, I got four in like between 6.30 and 9.30, and most of the time he's walking down the home, it was like bang, bang, bang. But right. I yeah, so you caught a bunch of them here last week. Last Sunday, right awesome. there, I was standing, on, well, that rock's underwater now. Yep. I, I was rigging on that rock, and I was going right in that foam patch. Okay, okay, so maybe we can fish bang, a little bang, further bang. down, but I mean, thanks. It's sunny, but they're there. I just, caught a, I just caught a couple rock bass. I caught some green sunfish. That's the first trout yeah, I caught you know, today, the, so. The smallmouth are moving. And That's even exciting. Rain, That's exciting. The day of the rain, which I think was Sunday morning, I was down further. And I got uh, a small mouth. That wouldn't have been much on my spinner rig, but on this, it scared me. Boom. Yeah. <laughs> you were killing them with that? That's awesome. Yeah, no. This, uh, the, my, it's one and a half pound test. I gotta, I gotta get more into it. People look at me like I'm an idiot with this thing. It's like, what are you using that thing for? I said, it's, look, look. I have my spinner rig in the car just in case, but I never end up using it. This does all the work. That's awesome. Cool. Yeah, What's your name? I totally converted. What's your name, sir? I'm Pete. Pete, I'm Tim. How you yeah. doing? I'll catch you around. I've yeah. been here every day since I got this. I'll I'll put you on my channel. channel. Well, I'll catch you again. Okay. All right. All right. Make nice. sure I have some with me. Ab absolutely. I'm come back. <laughs> okay. We scouted around. Something's right there. By the base of the dam, I saw a head pop up. There it goes again. I don't know if the camera can pick it up at all. Or maybe I'm seeing things. Maybe my, uh, maybe it's time for my medication. I don't know. We pretty much are gonna sum it up here. We got one brown, caught a bunch of green sunfish, caught one interesting shiner, some rockfish. So all in all, it wasn't a bad day. We're gonna do one last cast here. The guy we bumped into said he caught a bunch of browns. He caught his limit last uh, last Sunday he was here. So we're gonna try one more time. What am I holding on to here? What an interesting day. I found a, another guy who likes to use a cane pole. His was a lot more advanced than mine. I'm gonna probably do some more research. Oh, I thought a bite there. So, I hope you like this video. We caught rock bass, caught some green sunfish. Did get one brown, and we bumped into a guy with some advice. And that's the other thing when you're fishing too. It's always nice to just ask people around you, hey, dude, what are you using? What are you fishing with? What did you catch last time you were here? little information goes a long way so thank you for watching guys please please like and subscribe um i hope to have more trout videos hope to have more uh surf videos coming up i'm seeing people catch a lot in the surf so uh i will talk to you guys later thanks for watching guys And this is something no fisherman should be without, an inner tube and some water wings. So, be back to pick you up later.